Hello, welcome to English for Everyone. Today we're going to learn the irregular plurals. These are words that when you make them plural, we don't put S. We change the pronunciation completely. We're going to practice the pronunciation and we're going to practice using them. They are one man, two men, one woman, two women, one person, two people, one child, two children, one foot, two feet. One tooth and two teeth, one mouse, two mice, one goose and two geese. First we have man. One man, two, three, four, five, three men. So the pronunciation is a little different. One man, three men. Let's look closer at the pronunciation. Pronunciation, one man. Hmm. Ah. Ma, m, man, open sound, man, one man, two, m, eh, eh, me, me, m, men. It's closed, more closed, eh, eh, and it's short, eh, eh, me, me, men. So again, one man, two men, men. Let's practice. Is the man happy? Yes, the man is happy. What are the men doing? The men are talking. Is the man happy? What are the men doing? Very good. Next we have woman. One woman. Two women. Three women. A lot of women. Remember, no woman's, no women's, no s. We change the pronunciation. Again, one woman and three women. Let's look closer at the pronunciation. Pronunciation, one woman. Wu wu. U wu wu. M wum. Wum. U wuma. Wuma. M. Woman, woman, one woman, two, w, i, we, m, wim, i, wime, m, women, women, two women, three women, four women. So again, one woman and two women. Let's practice. Do you know that woman? No, I don't know that woman. How many women are there? There are three women. Do you know that woman? How many women are there? Very good. One person. Two, three, four, five people. Remember, we don't say persons and we don't say peoples. It's one person, more than one people. Let's look closer at the pronunciation. Pronunciation, one person. P, er, per, s, purse, a, persa, m, person. One person and two, p, e, p, p, peep, a, peep, l, people, people. One person, two people. Let's practice. Do you know that person? No, I don't know that person. How many people are there? There are five people. Do you know that person? How many people are there? Very good. Next we have child. One child. Two, three, four children. So remember, there's no childs and there's no childrens. There's no s. We change the pronunciation. I have one child, or maybe you have four children. There are four children in the class. How many people are in the class? There are five people in the class. How many children? There are four children in the class. Pronunciation: one child. I chai, l child, d 
child, child, one child, two, ch, i, ch, l, chill, j, j, chill, j, er, children, e, children, m, children. Remember the dr makes a j sound, so use that j, children. Two children, three children. One child, two children. Let's practice. How many children do you have? I have one child. How many children are in the classroom? There are four children in the classroom. How many people are in the classroom? There are five people in the classroom. How many children does she have? How many children are there in the classroom? How many people are there in the classroom? Very good. Example, foot. One foot, two feet. No foots, no feet, no S. Change your pronunciation. So this is one foot. I have two feet. She has two feet. And when you measure in standard measurements in the United States, we use one foot to measure or two feet, three feet, four feet. Pronunciation, one foot. F, uh, uh, foot, t, foot. It's a stop T, so we don't say foot. We put our tongue up and stop, foot, foot, one foot. Remember the sound, it's the short, uh, 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 foot. Not the long oo, not foo, but uh, foot, one foot. Two or more. E, fee, t, feet. Again, a stop T. Feet, feet. Not the short I, not fit, but the long E, fee, feet. Two feet, three feet, four feet, five feet. More than one, feet. But one, foot. Let's practice. Does your foot hurt? No, my foot doesn't hurt. Does her foot hurt? Very good. Do your feet hurt? No, my feet don't hurt. Do her feet hurt? Very good. Next we have tooth. One tooth. Two, three, four, teeth. So no tooths and no teeths, no S. We change the pronunciation. Again, one tooth, 32 teeth. Most people have 32 teeth. Tooth is singular. We use the singular form to describe. Example, this is a toothbrush, not a teeth brush. It is a toothbrush. And I brush my teeth with toothpaste, not teeth paste. It's singular for description. Toothpaste and toothbrush. Pronunciation, one tooth. T, ooh, two. T, tooth, tooth. One tooth. More than one, two, three, four, five. T, e, T. Teeth. Teeth. So remember, we start with a T sound with our tongue inside. T -t -t -t, and we finish with the TH with the tongue touching the teeth, making the air. So inside. T -t -t -t. T teeth. Two teeth. Three teeth. 32 teeth. So again, one tooth. More than one. Teeth. Let's practice. Does your tooth hurt? No, my tooth doesn't hurt. Does her tooth hurt? Very good. Do you brush your teeth with toothpaste? Yes, I brush my teeth with toothpaste. Do you brush your teeth with toothpaste? Very good. Next, we have Mouse. One mouse. Two, three, mice. 
we don't say mouses and we don't say mices. One mouse, two mice. This mouse is cute. He's a cartoon mouse. But these mice are not cute. Do you have mice in your house? I don't have mice in my house. And I don't want mice in my house. Pronunciation, one mouse. Hmm. Ow, mouse. S, mouse. One mouse. Two, three, four, five. Hmm. I, my. S, mice. One mouse, two, three, four, five, mice. I don't like mice. Let's practice. Do you think the mouse is cute? Yes, I think the mouse is cute. Do you think the mouse is cute? Very good. Do you think mice are cute? No, I don't think mice are cute. Do you think mice are cute? Very good. And the last one is goose. This is a goose. One goose and two geese. We don't say gooses and we don't say geeses. It's one goose and two geese. There is a goose in the park. Or there are many geese in the park. Pronunciation, one goose. G, u, gu, s, goose. Goose, one goose. One goose and two geese. G, e, gi, s, geese. Two, three, four geese. One goose and two geese. Is there a goose in the park? Yes, there is a goose in the park. Is there a goose in the park? Very good. How many geese are in the water? There are two geese in the water. How many geese are in the water? Very good. So, practice more with your irregular plurals. These are all the irregular plurals that you need to know. Practice more so you don't make mistakes with them. Remember, one man, two men, one woman, two women, one person, two people, one child, two children, one foot, two feet, one tooth, two teeth, one mouse, two mice, and one goose, two geese. Thank you for watching, and if you want to improve your pronunciation and avoid making mistakes in English, subscribe to our channel. Have a good day!